recent Bold Creek fire is a reminder of the rugged terrain where wildfires often spark, often hard to reach, and sometimes tough to spot. Wildfires don't happen in metro areas, they happen in remote areas. John Saw is the executive vice president of advanced and emerging tech at T-Mobile. Some of their towers are now home to cameras searching for signs of smoke or flames. When you fight fires, every minute counts. These 360 degree cameras designed by Pano AI use artificial intelligence to identify fires and notify agencies. The first responders get a live video feed of the fire pushed to their phones or pushed to their email, and they can share that incident feed with other agencies. Agencies in five states are using the technology, California, Oregon, Montana, Idaho, and Colorado. Clicking on, you can see the smoke column. In Colorado, right firefighters there. say the tool is helping them navigate a growing number of fires with faster winds. What happens is we get a report of a smoke call. Pano AI says it uses the same kind of AI used in many home security cameras and relies on a 5G network, which T-Mobile says delivers live video faster than past technology could. So you can get this information um, to the AI system a lot faster, almost real time. Company, how much it would potentially cost to install these for an agency in Washington. They said that it really depends and it's on a case by case basis, so it's hard for them to give an exact price range. I did reach out to Boulder County. They have about 330,000 people in that county, and they said that they did install three stations as part of a pilot program. Those cost about $25,000 each. Doesn't say that it would be exactly the same if it was here, but there was a general ballpark elsewhere. For now, we're live in Seattle. Erica Zuko, King 5 News.